Hi everyone, I brought in a Pioneer DH1500UBG car radio, which was repaired by another repairman. It burned out low frequency amplifier chip, but instead of PAL-011, soldered some TDA. And everything seems to work, it switches on, even the sound is there. But after some time the sound disappears and the inscription MP error. Amplifier error appears. The thing is that in Palo 11 protection or diagnostics goes on pin 25 of the chip. In TDA it seems to be the same. But apparently the principle of operation is a little different. As a result we get an amplifier error. You can buy an original chip but there is a less expensive way. First you need to disassemble the case. Unsolder pin 25 from the board which I have already done. Find the small transistor number Q302 and jumper its collector to the emitter or to the minus of the power supply. I connect to the emitter. And it has zero resistance with the case of the tape recorder. In turn pin 25 is connected to the base of this transistor through a 10 kilo ohm resistor. There are different ways to do it. To connect the collector and minus power supply with a wire or to put a small jumper between the collector and the emitter, which I will do now. Let's use the help of a microscope. Try to put extra solder on the lead. That's why the area around the transistor is so dirty. I'll add some flux. And now the hardest part is to solder the jumper. It's done! I removed the flux residue. Let's try to switch it on. The test point is passed. Produced by Bannon. It took almost 3 minutes, the flight is normal, and so in fact, if there is no desire to spend a large amount of money on the original chip, you can solder one of the many TDA with a similar pinout, a little wizardry with a jumper, and listen to your favorite music without the error MP error. Thanks for watching, good luck, bye!